I would say Women's History Month means that it's a time to celebrate the women of the past. This was about, for me, uh, the ability to go, okay, let's think back on what the Marine Corps has done for you, and if you can talk about that in some fashion, um, and it provides value to somebody else, then maybe it's a conversation that's worth having. What it means to me um, to be a woman working alongside these men, it's a high honor because not everyone gets to do this every day I get up. I get to show not only who I am, but who all other women have the potential to be. I decided to do ITV due to the fact I wanted to see if I can do it. There was nothing that told me that if I fail it, something bad was going to happen. It was all volunteer. It's always been about capability. That's what's so great about where we are right now as a service and as a, as a core. I'm not defined by my gender. I'm defined by what I do on a daily basis and how well I work and perform. My gender doesn't really have an issue with the workplace. Over my 30 years in the Marine Corps, um, my experience is you know, in terms of how women have evolved has been very positive. Uh, Sarah Deal, the first female aviator, she was supposed to be an air traffic controller over here when I was a lieutenant. And when the Marine Corps opened aviation to women, Sarah uh, made that jump. And uh, I was able to serve with her in Iraq uh, during the first Iraq war. Phenomenal woman. My experience, all the women I've worked with are phenomenal. But so are all the men, right? because we are pretty selective. I mean, we are a meritocracy in the Marine Corps. We look for talent. It's easier to identify a male Marine versus a female just because of the haircut, but I think we all exude the same amount of confidence. We both are striving for the same goals and that if we're given the opportunity, we can reach them because that's what we do as Marines. I think it's been the trajectory uh, since I came in the Marine Corps in terms of how we think about women, a women's contribution to the service, um, it's, been, it's been a steady rise. I'm very, very hopeful with all the things that are going on right now that we are very, very deliberate and responsible. Uh, we understand war fighting and we're going to get it right. We're going to figure out, you know, how do we do this uh, right. We take care of our, our war fighting function and we, we excel at that. And whatever we do in terms of adding women's capability will be additive. Uh, and I'm, I, think, I think we're in a good place.